So I had this dream that I was at this big, beautiful ballroom in a hotel, like at the Four Seasons, and I had important people speaking on stage, and I rented this lens, and it was people like Rolex and Amazon and YouTube, oh, Snapchat, TikTok. Wait. That was my job last week. <laughs> So look, first things first, my oldest daughter graduated from college. She got her BFA in theater. Hey, so I'm almost uh, to Natchitoches. I had to leave at 4.45 in the morning, uh, it's a four hour drive to get over here. My daughter Julia is graduating from college today, man. She's getting her BFA in theater and uh, she's already got two jobs lined up. So I am so proud of her, man. Talk about, this is such a proud, crazy proud moment for me as a father. Um, but I'm like 20 minutes away from the hotel and I'm gonna change my clothes and go do this thing. Come and stay every time we come see Julia, man. Last time for me. <laughs> Our girl's graduating today. <laughs> So proud of her. So listen, recently I've been having a bunch of sessions outside, like at the park or the lakefront or whatever. It's something that I've been doing with my images that I love, I'm going to give to you for free. Oh, yeah. It is my Capture One preset. Uh, it's called Lights On. <laughs> it, it's just because it like brightens the image. It does a color balance, leans towards the warm side. And... Um, I'm not lying. I'll do after shoot to cull my images. Uh, take the selects. I apply this filter to the whole thing. Usually I have to go back and just adjust a few images here and there. Um, but I'm done. And I'm super duper happy with how quick my process is now. So look, in the link below, I have the uh, Google Drive download link for you to have this preset i would love to hear from you in the comments of how it works for you now granted i do shoot fuji i have other photographers that work with me from time to time whether it's canon or nikon um, i don't have anybody that are shooting sony hmm i just realized that and sometimes i'll do this filter on their work and it looks great and maybe just adjust um the white balance but it's a wonderful head start to uh, making images look fantastic, man. Yeah. <laughs> so, you're a working photographer. You are paid by the hour. Every time you hold this thing in your hand and you aim it at somebody, when you click that shutter, that's money, baby. Cha-chink, cha-chink. That could be money. So it's very important to get your exposures right. It's important to get it right in the camera. Um, us working pros are not living in Photoshop, man. Uh, we're Lightroom, a Capture One, and we're done. Usually Photoshop is just to retouch uh, an exit sign, kids scratch face if we have to, simple stuff. But I still photograph everything on complete manual. And uh, I like this camera a lot because of the foc focusing system. But I have to be honest, man, I still love my X-T4 more. Uh, I love those darn knobs, man. It's so easy to shutter speed, ISO, here's your, your f-stop. I mean, it, it's just so awesome. And um, I love on the Fuji cameras how I can see actual exposure on the back of that LCD. 
and it just makes my life a lot easier. So when I get home, I'm honestly just about done. There's a couple of times where my exposures may be a little hot or whatever, but um, yeah, man, that's why we shoot raw. Hey, I interrupt this video to show you a test of the DJI Pocket 3. This thing is insane, man. I've only had it out of the box for like, I don't know, maybe an hour. Of course, trying to figure out all the settings and all. How this thing balances light is unbelievable. Watch this. It's tracking me, right? Look how far away I am. Watch this. Hold on, hold on, turning. Oh yeah, hold on, where are we? Oh yeah. It, how far am I? 10, 20, I'm, I'm at least 20 to 30 yards away. This is insane. So look, watch this, watch this, watch this. I'm coming by the fence. Does it still have me? Does it still have me? It still has me. That is wild. I have an idea. Let's cook a steak and use this for B-roll. First, salt and pepper these beautiful steaks on all sides. Get some cracked black pepper on there. Remember your olive oil? And then get them on the grill. When you pull them off, boil the top of them, let them rest for a few minutes, and look at all the amazing juice it creates. Mm, mm, mm. Well, now that you're hungry, hope you take your camera today, go create something amazing, and uh, I'm sorry this video took a left turn, but how cool is this Osmo Pocket 3? Uh, you're gonna be seeing a lot more, well, for me in general because of this guy, but 100% more behind the scenes of how I do what I do because this thing can now follow me and track me, and it's, it's just awesome. Maybe I'll do a full review on this sucker when I get a chance, but uh, in the meantime, Thanks for being here. Have focus on your dreams, and I will see you in the next video. All right? All right? <laughs> Crazy!